So will Earthquake. Oh, they, they don't sneak. They don't have sneak. Oh, okay, well then it's it's uh, just a Charizard sweep. What's going on, trainers? Today we are trying to show off everyone's favorite non-Dragon Dragon Charizard. So, I did videos for the other two Kanto starters. I did Blastoise and I did Venusaur already. If you want to see those, check out the link in the description. Charizard, however, I wanted to do something a little different. We did Sun with Venusaur, and every time you see Charizard, you see Sun, you see Solar Power, you see Special Attacks. We're doing something a little different. We're going to be using Physically Attacking Swords Dance Charizard. Now, Swords Dance Charizard, you never see this because he only has an 84 base attack. So we got to help Charizard out. So a lot of the Pokemon on this team are, are here to kind of like directly support Charizard. So Charizard itself... We've got Terra Ground with Earthquake. Gives us offensive and defensive utility. Makes us immune to electric attacks. Resist rock attacks. Um, so we can Sword Stance up in the face of an electric type Pokemon. We got Flame Charge as well to increase our speed. We want to try to not click Flame Charge. We kind of want to use the Sticky Web from Spide Ops. Uh, and then we've got Flare Blitz. We're Blaze Charizard because Flare Blitz will get us into Blaze range. And when you are low HP, your fire type moves are increased with blaze. So we're using Flare Blitz. It's our strongest fire type move, chipping ourselves down. Just a fun, different take on Charizard. Physically defensive, Spide Ops here. Uh, great lead. You want to throw up sticky webs, maybe knock something off. Um, if there's a huge threat in front of you, you have counter. Uh, and then we've got Circle Throw, where if you, if you find a good matchup, you can just kind of quick Circle Throw and get a little bit of chip on things. Golden Go, also physically defensive. We got that air balloon here. This is like the best Golden Ghost set right here. Terra Fairy, Dazzling Gleam, Shadow Ball, Recover, Nasty Plot. We don't even have Make It Rain because you don't really need it. Like this is some great coverage as we already know with Fluttermane. Shadow Ball, Dazzling Gleam, that, that Ghost and Fairy combo is very strong. Brute Bonnet, Mixed Defenses, mostly physical. Uh, Synthesis, Spore, Bullet Punch, oh, pff, Bullet Seed, and Crunch with the Loaded Dice. You're here too. Soak up an attack and then dish out a little bit of damage, spread a spore or something. We're all just trying to slow the game down with these Pokemon so Charizard can get in and click Sword Stance. Then we've got our Flygon here. We've got an immunity to ground. Like this team here doesn't really care about hazards because we've got, you know, we've got Levitate. We have um, our Air Balloon on Golden Gold. We got Heavy Duty Boots. We got a prankster pokemon and our other two guys are already slow so we don't really care about like sticky web we don't care too much about stealth rock and spikes um so yeah we got flygon here with levitate we're just kind of uh, bouncing around with u-turn um this was my favorite set for the pokemon in ru back in gen 8 could probably change it now at this point to maybe find some better coverage you could put a dragon move in here um but i'm kind of just still rolling with it and then we got klefki um, just mixed defenses with spikes, reflect, light screen, and thunder wave. So, guys, um, there is a team code on the right. If you want to rent the team, let me know. Um, check out the other videos. And I hope you all enjoy this one. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new. I would love to get to 500 subscribers. And I would love to start a Discord when we get to 500. Um, so you guys can find some battles. Kind of create like a little battling network on Discord. Um, so let me know if you're interested in that by liking this video, commenting, and subscribing. Anyway, let's get on to the games. All right, uh, Charizard goes crazy against this team after we get a sword stance up. So, I'm guessing they maybe lead with the cat. Speed doesn't really make a difference. Like, I don't think I need sticky webs up in this game. Like, this dude is just so weak to ground. Flygon could also kind of just dismantle this team. Like, honestly, legitimately, could really, really destroy this team. If the Cerule Edge is Terra Grass, then we run into a huge problem, for the most part. Terra Grass Cerule Edge could uh, really do some work, especially if it's still, like, if it's still Flash Fire, if it's Flash Fire and Terra Grass. Oh, he, leads, he just leads off with it. Okay. Well, we're going to find out right now. We are going to find out right now. Is that shiny? Is that why his eyes are red? Or am I, um, am I tweaking? I'm going to knock. 
Oh, they just better blade right, right away. Could have just countered. Could have, should have, would have just countered. But I get it. All right, what do we got going on here? Okay, it's weak armor. Hmm. Okay. Okay. We can. Uh, we can handle this. Uh. We'll try to try to. We'll try to web. And then uh, we'll go to our uh, flygon, and then just kind of kind of see. Yep, go to Flygon. And uh, I think this should force a Terra if they've if they've got Terra. Um, and I am gonna Earthquake even if they Terra, because now we know the Charizard's a little faster, so. Like, it really doesn't matter, because we could go set up a Reflect. Oh, okay, they withdraw. Totally fine. Why would you go into... Oh, is it uh, Balloon? It's gotta be Balloon. I don't know why you just go right into this, unless it's Weakness Policy. Okay, so this tells me that they don't have... Like a Terra that can handle handle this. So what I'm going to do, okay. Actually, I, I want to just go to the keys, which I think I'm going to do. And then I'm going to set up a Reflect and just see if we can win with Charizard from there. I'm going to go, I'm going to go incredibly greedy and try to win the game right now. Okay, and they Terra. What do we got going on here? Here a ghost. Very, very interesting. Ice punch. Okay, I will. So we'll we'll test them out. We'll see if they got psychic fangs. Also, bro has nice colored eyes, just like me. All right, back into the rule edge. So we set up our Reflect. I am also going to paralyze this guy. I'm not going to touch him. I'm going to paralyze this guy. <laughs> of course, of course. Um, so that's a bummer. So I guess what's more important here? Uh, a spike? I think maybe a spike is more important, unfortunately. Yeah, I'll set up a spike because then... Because if Espeon is, um, man, that's a huge bummer, actually. If Espeon is Sash, then this helps us out a little bit. And they, land, they get to crit, too? Okay. So now we're kind of like at square one. But at least they used their Terra. So we're going to go out to the Zardinator. And we will sword stance first. And maybe we'll catch a crazy switch into something. Maybe we'll catch something. Maybe he's banded. I think I'm just kind of like wishful thinking at this point, but maybe he's banded. Okay, that makes me think maybe he is he's banded. Tyranitar. Okay, this is perfect. So Sandstorm's gonna kick up. We hit the swords dance. Gonna take a little bit of chip. Okay, let's Let's take a... I'm going to see how much damage we do with Earthquake. Alright, so I'm going to Terra, and I'm going to Flame Charge first, and hope this is not an absolute throw. 
I'm going to flame charge. And then we're going to earthquake. Which should knock this out, even if it's max HP. It, like, it has to be physically offensive to live this. So, assume they go for a rock move. Maybe they'll even miss. We're gonna go Flame Charge here so we can get in front of Espeon. Please don't crunch. Rock Slide, okay. And with the Reflect, alright, we're set up, baby. We're absolutely set up. And now we just EQ and pick up this KO. Like I said, they have to be physically defensive to live this. The only thing... Oh, what, what do we got going on here? Only thing we were, like, really worried about is... Okay, yep, so I was just going to say, like, maybe some priority is what we're worried about. But that's one of their prior priority users down. They are sacking this. Makes me nervous about, like, where they might go, potentially. Afterward, like, maybe they've got Scarf Espeon. Charizard's not very tanky, so we are just... We're just hanging in there. Alright, so out comes Chandelure. Gonna take some spike damage. See, and this is another reason we hit the Flame Charge, just in case. Just in case this is Scarf, we're always faster. Because we're jolly. Yeah, yeah, yep, 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 yep. That might be it, ladies and gentlemen. That might be the whole game already. If not, we've got Flygon in the back. They've already used their Terra. Like, we don't have to overthink anything. Oh, well, Palace Sand could live. Mm, yeah, Palace Sand, Palace Sand takes some hits pretty easily. Mm, let's see here. I think it is still just smart. Like, as much as I want to click Flare Blitz. If this is physically defensive, we need um, a couple Earthquakes to knock it out. As much as I want to click Flare Blitz, but I'll wait until we are in um, in range. In, in uh, Blaze range. Okay. Okay, big damage. Sludge Bomb. Shouldn't do a lot. Of course they poison me. Oh, man. Of course they poisoned me. Of course. Man, if we didn't get poisoned, like, it is just a straight up sweep. Because now they could revenge with, um, Cerulege. Especially, yeah, now that the, the Reflect is off, too. Yeah, they could revenge with Cerulege now. With Shadow Sneak. They needed, they needed Chip for that, and now they've got it. So we'll see. Charizard's not uh, not very bulky, but like regardless, like Charizard put in tons of work here. All right, back out to Tyranitar. You know what we're clicking here? We're clicking Earthquake. But yeah, I think they're just they're just stalling. They're looking for turns so they can get Cerulege back in. They're gonna try to win the game between Cerulege and Espeon. All right, so we are definitely in range of Shadow Sneak here. Alright, out comes Cerule Edge. I think... I think a Shadow Sneak comes in here. Um, Shadow Sneak could come in, but then, like, we can just go to Brute Bonnet and Crunch. So, like, if they're banded... You know? Yeah, I think we should be good. So, we'll Earthquake. Oh, they, they don't Sneak. They don't have Sneak. Oh, okay, well then it's it's uh, just a Charizard sweep. Literally just a Charizard sweep. Alright, Espeon, one more. I, I think, I think this is the last one. Let's find out. Yup, 
Did Charizard knock out every single Pokemon? He did, didn't he? He knocked out every single Pokemon. Well, I mean, except this Espeon, but it was getting knocked out. I'm going to tell you that right now. So there you guys have it. Charizard knocking out six Pokemon. Okay, we got a Mono Grass team. That is great news for Charizard. We don't even have to Terra. So... I'm very foolishly, I think I'm going to leave with this and not even like think about it. And then we kind of just go from there. Like team preview is uh, pretty easy. Charizard could uh, really put in some work here. We got to watch out for the Terra though. Ruban, it looks horrible here. Except for like, I guess against, you know, like Arbalava or something like that. I don't know. Doesn't look great. Charizard looks great. We need to bait a Terra out when Charizard is not out. But I don't know exactly kind of how we do that. So we'll see. All right, Mask Rattle lead. I think we always put up Sticky Web in front of this. I think they are probably just going to U-turn or knock off. Do they have a Rapid Spinner? No. Um... Yeah, so we'll throw we'll throw up webs. Triple axle, okay. Mmm okay. Okay, that hurts, that hurts. But they are now an ice type. Okay, life orb. Interesting. Uh yeah, we can revenge with uh Flygon potentially. Potentially triple axle life orb. It's actually a problem. Uh, we'll just circle throw them out of here if we can. Oh, copycat? Okay, that's sick. That's actually amazing. That is so cool, dude. <laughs> Kudos. Kudos. Oh my god. Actually, that's horrible. That's so bad. Okay, copycat again. Circle throw me. That was so cool, dude. That was awesome. So we need them to not hit three triple axles. Okay. But it failed. All right, get him out of here. Get him out of here. And it was super effective damage. That's actually a big relief because now that... Because that Miascarata could have been horrible for us. I am going to knock this guy off. Hopefully they don't just like calm mind up in our face. We could definitely lose to this if it's Terra Water, which it should be, which most of them are. Scald, we live. Go ahead and burn us, honestly. Okay. Mm. Yeah, we don't really want to switch into this, do we? We could save this for a sack. We could go to the keys, which I think is actually a great idea. We'll save this. So we'll go to the keys. We'll thunder wave. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what they want to do. Strength sap. Okay. It's fine. Go ahead. Heal up. Sinistra is a big old problem. Um, I'm gonna spike once. Spike once. See what they want to do. If they call mind, I'll thunder wave. Okay, scald. Okay, I'm gonna thunder wave again while I've got the chance here. Because this thing is a big threat. This is probably the biggest threat to the team. Biggest threat to Charizard. And they're just going to keep Scalding. They're going to get the burn. And now I will set up some screens here. We'll light screen first. Light screen first, and then uh, put up a reflect, maybe. Kind of just depending. Uh, 
Yeah, I think we will. We'll put up a reflect. And then we'll just stack spikes and we'll potentially go into Charizard. I just don't want them to be Terra Water. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Our Bolivar coming out. Curious what they're going to do here. I'm kind of thinking about getting them all up. Because they're probably going to earth power here. Only one layer of spikes. Yeah, I'm I'm going to get a... Mm, do I want free turns against this? That's the question. Now, I'll put up a spike. Gotta chip things down as much as possible for Charizard. Oh, Leech Seed, that's annoying. Super annoying. Okay, so we'll just, uh, we'll just put, we'll just keep going with this. Get up every single layer. Okay, they, they do have Earth Power. So Leech Seed, Earth Power, gonna guess Giga Drain. What is the last move? Is Hyper Voice the last move? Um, kind of want to go Charizard here and see if we can bait out a Terra, maybe. Yeah, we'll Swords Dance. Swords Dance, they'll probably go into Ogre Pond, at which point we can Terra and then just Earthquake. And just go from there. Okay, they're gonna commit to Terra themselves, so they tear water. That's the question. Terra poison. Okay. That's honestly maybe okay. Depending what they hit us with here. Hey, they leech seed. Okay, can we... Like, honestly, this is great. This is... I think this is okay because we just stay in and we just weaken this team like crazy at this point. Um, Do we need the Terra to knock this out? It's a roll, depending on what their spread is. Mm, I think it might be okay to Terra just to guarantee knock this out. Depending on what their spread is, if if it's got some physical defense, we we need the Terra for the guaranteed KO. So, we'll just uh, earthquake here, and then we'll just we'll just kind of see. Okay, big damage. There's one. Interesting Terra there. I like Terra Fairy on our Balaba. I like how Charizard's wings are like creating this little sun flare on the screen when they flap up and down. Sinistra, okay. Sinistra's out. They don't have a Terra. We are going to Flare Blitz here. I'm guessing Flame Charge won't KO. Oh, this thing is so bulky. It could even potentially live Flame Charge. Oh, not Flame Charge. I didn't want to Flame Charge. No, I misclicked. I wanted to Flare Blitz. Oh no, don't do it to us. Oh, thank God. That was so dumb. Alright, well now we got a Flare Blitz. 
Lost a little bit of extra health there for no reason. But luckily our next attack will be in blaze range. Copycat, triple axle. I'm curious if they've got sucker punch on their cat. Thank God for the light screen. Saved us there. Because I'm not paying attention. Okay, into Meowskarada. This makes me think that potentially that they have um, Sucker Punch. Do I want to preserve this is the question. Do I need to preserve this? That's the question. How would I beat... Well, I guess I would beat the Diplin with Golden Go. I guess that would be my best bet. So we will... We'll Flame Charge. Okay, they do have Sucker Punch. Okay. Good job, Charizard. You did good. You did good. Picked up a couple of KOs on some really bulky Pokemon. Okay, so now the question is... How do we want to go about handling this guy from here? Man, this guy is like useless. But I don't want to get sucker punched with Flygon. So we'll see what they end up doing here. Like I'm I'm just gonna bullet seed, I think. Well, uh, no. Crunch is waste miner. I'll crunch. And hopefully they kind of just I guess it doesn't matter. Like they can U turn out. Yeah, that's fine. Like we can we can just keep crunching now. I think now we kind of just soften the team up as best as we can with this guy. And just see where it gets us. Hopefully it's not the infestation uh, Diplin. That would be a big pain. Okay, so this... We'll see, this might have close combat. Alright, booster energy. We'll see, yeah, this might have close combat. Yeah, it probably, probably does. Just wondering how badly do we still need this. Honestly, it's still pretty good. I wonder if I should go to Golden Go. Because this is still good against Ogre Pond. But so is gold, so I'll, uh, I'll just crunch. Okay, Sacred Sword. Oh my gosh, so bulky, dude. This Pokemon is so good. This Pokemon is so freaking good, dude. How did we live that? All right, into Diplin. I'm gonna synthesis once. Cause like we could just we could honestly kind of just like one v one this team at this point. Dude, yeah, this Pokemon is so good. I have no idea how we lived that. Attack booster? There's no way, dude. Oh, Dragon Tail. Okay, okay, okay. Well, if he gets Flygon. Okay, this is this is fine. Sort of. I actually don't want this. I don't want to lose this. Uh... Well, it doesn't matter. Losing a balloon here doesn't matter. So, we'll Gleam. Okay, yeah, yeah. GG's, GG's. Charizard paving the way for a victory there. Cool Mono Grass team, though. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed the Charizard Showcase. We've got all three Kanto starters done. Uh, and I have sprinkled in a few other starter videos. If you're looking for another starter, let me know who you want to see featured. Um, see if I can whip something up. Otherwise, guys, I will catch you on the next one. Peace.